Hey Nerd Herd, Rich Dotson here with another Dynasty Nerds video talking about a great sneaky wide receiver stash that I think fits any Dynasty roster, whether you're being rebuild mode or contender mode. And that wide receiver is Kyle Phillips of the Tennessee Titans. Yes, the Tennessee Titans that were dead last in receiving la yards last year. Yes, the Tennessee Titans that have no receiver on the roster has a career 500 yard season. Yes, that Tennessee Titan team. And yes, I'm talking Kyle Phillips, the slot receiver for the Tennessee Titans. You know, what I like about Kyle Phillips is He's a real savvy route runner with really quick feet. And he's shown over his career, definitely at UCLA, that he is consistently able to get separation from defensive backs and get open. And that's what wins in the today's NFL. In the slot receiver, we've already seen see more uptick in production over the last couple of years. And we all know the Titans are going to run the football a ton. But in today's NFL, you've got to throw the football. And outside of Traylon Burks, there's not a really a lot of options at the receiver position. And yes, I love Chig Okanakwo at the tight end position as another sneaky stash or upside player. But the receiver position, there's not a lot of competition outside of Traylon Burks. This is a team that added no wide receiver help in the NFL draft outside of their seventh round pick, Colton Dow out of University of Tennessee at Martin. And we don't look for him to contribute at all. You have Nick Westbrook Akini at the other receiver position who play outside of Traylon Burks. But it will be Kyle Phillips in the slot, and we look for him to see a lot of targets and help out uh, Ryan Tannehill, seeing that Traylon Brooks will see the ton of number one coverage there for the defensive from the defensive backs. And Kyle Phillips, you know, it's just about target share, like I mentioned before. If you go back just two years ago to 2021, a player that you kind of comp to Kyle Phillips, it's Hunter Renfro. Uh, yes, Hunter Renfro has better hands than Kyle Phillips, but they're both savvy route runners. Yeah, can get open and produce with the receptions in PPR games. And what did Kyle, Connor Renfro do two years ago in that position with other receivers hurt, and he was put in that front line to see the target share? He finished as wide receiver number 10 overall in PPR leagues. And it's not that I think Kyle Phillips is going to finish as wide receiver 10, but I think he's going to give you enough produ production this year to possibly be a nice wide receiver 3 or the upside of a being a wide receiver too. That's a startable player. That's a flex player that can be had right now for pennies on the dollar. In Dynasty, we love to add young wide receivers to our rosters, ones that could help in the time of need. And Kyle Phillips fits that mold. We are constantly looking for players that are in position to win. And that's what Kyle Phillips, Phillips is going to do this year. You know, Brian Tannehill, we don't know how long he's going to last uh, as a starter with the drafting of Will Levis. But that's besides the point. We have a position player here in position with very little competition and in line to see a huge increase in target share uh, overall. So if you want a good player that can stash on your roster for disgustingly cheap with the upside, that's not going to cost you anything if you miss. It's going to be Kyle Phillips of the Tennessee Titans. Go out there, so some trade offers. You might be able to get him for a nice hot sandwich and get the production that reaps the rewards of a full seven course meal. Get out there, make some trades. Let's see the upside. Let's see what he could do this year. I expect him to, to see that range of right around 80 targets and come away with anywhere from 50 to 75 receptions if he sees a higher target share. And he, that's what's gonna win. He's gonna win in receptions in PPR leagues. Go out there, make some offers and see if he could help your team this year, either in rebuild mode or contender. If you think this video is helpful, hit that like, subscribe button to stay up on all our Dynasty content to help you build a contended Dynasty team, not just for this year, but for years to come.